y'all i've been waiting for this day all week it's finally here jazz like the music if it's your first time welcome welcome and if you coming back i don't know why you coming back because you want another video and guess who's about to give it to you guess who's about to give it to you so this intro is going to be a little longer but just bear with me because i'm going to have a giveaway at the end okay so today uh i am actually wanting to do with everything going on in the world the pandemic and stuff like that i really think it's important that you know we support small businesses. Every two weeks, I will be a re reviewing a um, a small business. I'm not gonna lie, I am uh, particularly looking for small black and brown owned businesses, but any small business will suffice if y'all have any suggestions. Uh, so I'm doing things from restaurants, I'm doing things like candy, bath bombs, clothing, whatever it is. So the point of this is let's get our economy back up and running and let's support somebody's dream for real. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to buy something from that small business. Um, I'm going to review it here. And then at the end, if they pass the rating, then I'm gonna give away either a gift card or an item from, from, from that store, from that business or something like that. What people th I think have the biggest issue with, with small businesses, black owned businesses, brown owned businesses, is unfortunately there's always the concern of maybe quality or customer service or things like that. So I just wanna be clear, I'm not here to bash anyone or anybody's business, but maybe we can use this as a platform for growth. And also, you know, if some people are scared to try, I'm gonna try it for you so you can review it right here and then y'all already know it's good. So from start to finish, I'm going to show y'all what everything looks like. I'm, I'm just everything. So there's no confusion, okay? I just want to get that part clear. All right, guys. So just stay tuned to the end of the video. Um, and then just see if it passes the rating. And then see what you need to do to qualify for my giveaway. Uh, but with that being said, let's just jump right into it, okay? So today I am doing a review over candy. So the name of the business is called Chupale Mix uh, Chamoy and Candy. So obviously it's gonna be Mexican candy. So I have one, two, three. I got six different candies. And now this packaging, I think it's pretty great. Now first let's start off with, um, look at this y'all. This is filled to the rim. Like as you can see, just the size of my hand, it's basically bigger than about the size of my hand. And uh, I will tell you all the kinds I have. So first I got the peach rings. Look at that, y'all. It is drenched in that. So I got peach rings. I have the Sour Patch Watermelons. I have, um, I believe these are the like Airhead Extremes. Uh, Gushers. Gushers. I've been really wanting these. And then uh, Fruit Roll-Ups. Two Fruit Roll-Ups. The Fruit by the Foot and then um, just the regular fruit roll-ups. I will rate this packaging a five, um, just cause it, I mean, it looks really good. It's really professional, like it's sealed off. Now let me go through price before I get into it. So for the candies on her site, she has more than what I have here today, um, but the candies, they're going to be $5. Now I do think this is a good amount for $5. Um, $5 for these, um, like the Sour Patch and things like that but the fruit roll-ups are $3 and those come with two. So the fruit by the foot comes with two as well as the fruit roll-ups, they come with two. So these are $3, whereas these are $5. But she also has some, the chamoy, uh, the little mix, and it's so good, guys. I didn't, I didn't buy any, but I have tried it. She has different flavors. Um, she has like the regular, she has watermelon. I believe she has cucumber. I tried the watermelon. My cousin actually has it. And she served me a watermelon Moscato. She dipped the rim though before in the chamoy mix, the watermelon chamoy. And then she put some tahini on the rim. Oh my God. Now my mouth is salivating thinking about it, it was so good. So as far as price, 
I, I, price I'm, I'm, I'm gonna give her i'm gonna give her a 4.5 i'm gonna give her a 4.5 i will say i think it's really good because this is probably the best pricing i found either it's similar to this or it's more expensive people be charging six seven dollars for one of these so save my dollar save my dollar so as far as pricing and then the way she stuffed this bad boy you know what i'm saying i'll give her my five dollars customer service <laughs> Now, I did not go pick this stuff up, but my cousin picked it up and apparently she's just a very, very sweet individual. Like my aunt orders from her and y'all don't know my aunt, but ooh, she's the most difficult person in our family. Love you, girl. But if she can deal with her, she's nice. So customer service is great. You order from her um, through the week. She takes orders through the week and then uh, you pick up on uh, the weekend. So the location though, if it's not convenient for you, that's the only thing uh, she doesn't deliver now. She's uh, not that big. I don't know if she would start doing it, but right now she's not. So unfortunately for the uh, the giveaway, you would have to be here. Honestly, unless you're willing to give me your address then I would gladly mail them to you. I just don't know what it would, if it would melt on the way, but I'd be happy to do that. But if you do live in Houston, Texas, um, the zip code is 77044. That's the area where she lives in. So it's off of like by near CE King, if you know where uh, the Beltway and 90 is, that's where she's located. So you do have to drive and go pick it up. But all through the weekend, she's available for pickup. You can DM her, that's how you order. They're good to go. All right, so customer service, again, I would give a five. She was great, there was no complaints. Uh, all right, so now the moment of truth. Let's try these bad boys, guys. Let's see. So I'm gonna start with the peach rings. I'm gonna start with the peach rings because my cousin said these were her absolute favorite. She also said the cherry bombs are her favorite. I'm not a big cherry bomb person, but I can imagine in there. Okay, let's see what we have here. Let's see what this is hitting for. Look at that. Hmm. This girl knows what she's doing. Peach rings are good. The gushers and the watermelon is what I was really excited about. So let's go ahead and try these gushers. They are in there. The only thing is they are a little stuck together, of course, because it's like they're sticky. Look at that. Look at that. It's like what, two, three of them? Who knows? Man. These gushers are where it's at. Y'all. I've been waiting for this day all week. It's finally here. All right, watermelon. These I have high expectations for because I love the little sandia lollipops with the chile on them. Oh my gosh, those go hard in the paint. So that's why I wanted these. Mm. These are good, y'all. Let me tell you, there's not one bite that's not gonna have some spice to it. <laughs> that's enough to excite your girl. I think these are the Airheads Extreme. Airheads Extremes, Airhead Extremes. Who cares? Airheads. So, hmm. See, one little piece, Airhead. Just in case y'all didn't know which one I was talking about. If I'm being honest, so far, these are my least favorite. Now, if you like these airheads, you might love these, but everything else was just easier to chew through. These are a little tougher and they don't have as much flavor to me. Like, of course you taste the, um, the spice, the chamoy, uh, the tahine, everything on it, you taste the whatever concoction she put on this, you taste it, but you don't really taste the candy. 
So that's where it's like the other ones, you taste the watermelon, you taste the fruitiness of the gushers, when you taste the peach, so it's good. This, that thing chewy. Mm. Fruit by the foot. <laughs> you know what they say about these. The fun goes on and on. This is good. Mm -hmm. You can tell as you put the, um, you know, all the stuff that she puts on it for the fruit roll-ups. Maybe because they're thinner, it makes them a little softer. But it's not bad. Like I would order it again, but if I didn't have this one as well, I'd be fine. But it's really good, it's really good. Like this one is worth like trying it. Like you gotta get it just to try it out. You have this one, this little guy. All right, so lastly, we have the fruit roll-up, a regular fruit roll-up. Now this one I'm a little confused by. It's a little more difficult, like as you unwrap it, it's just kind of, oh, there we go. Came off. I can see how like, like I was saying before, it makes them mushy, so some of it is a little more difficult to get off, but. Mm-hmm. That's good. That's really good. I don't know if there's a better way to do this. I'm not gonna lie. It does make them like, like you can't fully get it off. I think that's with anybody you're gonna order from. Like it can come off, I promise you. I'm about to, if I have to put this whole paper in my mouth, I will. Like it is going, it tastes good. But I don't know if there's a better way for them to maybe, um, anybody that sells these for them to get it to not like just stick to the paper the way it does you know the other one the fruit by the foot came off with that problem i was saying that it basically had this one has got it stuck but man it's worth the fight it's worth the struggle when you get it off it's good it's good i'm not gonna finish that obviously i'll be here all day I will go in on this on, on camera. All right, guys. And that's all of them. That's all of them. So um, I'm not gonna lie. Overall quality, um, well, the quality of it is gonna, I'm gonna give it a 4.5. Um, and for overall, just the whole experience, I'm gonna give it a solid four. Bringing the grand total to an average of 4.6. So it made it made it through <laughs> but so let me tell you the only things i um i didn't like everything tasted good like i said my favorites i will still to the uh like after trying all of them my favorites are going to be the uh the watermelon the gushers the peach rings those were really good those three were really good i did like the fruit by the foot the fruit roll up on the roll that was really good the only ones that i was like yeah i'll still eat them i'm gonna eat them but <laughs> the ones i only that i personally don't like are the airhead extremes they were just a little too tough for me the candy itself what she added to it was good but those candies are just a little too bland so i didn't like it so you know just my recommendation if you love those try it you would love it um and the uh the other fruit roll up uh this one just because it was just more difficult to get off still good still gonna eat it but if you're gonna get it for roll up, honestly, my recommendation would get would be to get the other one. But for the first time, if you were to try both, you would not be disappointed in taste. It's just more time consuming. Like if you don't want your hands all sticky, that one's going to get you there. So overall, we have a 4.6. So with the conclusion of this video, um, like I said, we're supporting businesses. I supported her business by purchasing from her and now to continue that support, I will be giving away um, $25 to her store, um, to her brand, to her business, for you to choose whatever you like, up to $25. This ain't like rollover minutes. If you don't spend it, it don't, it don't come to you. So spend all 25. I'm not cash apping anything. I'm giving her $25. You can get whatever you want. If it exceeds that amount, you're more than welcome to pay the difference because we're here to support. But $25 to her business, which will get you a 
heck of a lot because what I, all of that was, let's see, 5, 10, 15, 20, I think it was about 25 or 26 bucks. So $25. Uh, try it out and then just tell a friend. Tell a friend about her if you absolutely like it. So the way to participate in this competition, all you have to do is like this video, like it, <laughs> and then uh, add her on Instagram. Uh, so her Instagram name is um, chupalemix underscore chamoy, and I will add that here. And then add me on Instagram, meanery, I'll add that right here. And then after you're done doing all of that, uh, just DM me personally and say done. Okay, and I'll probably just for fun by then I'll probably post a picture of this if you want to go and like it That's fine. But again Add me uh, like the video uh, Add her on Instagram add me on Instagram as soon as you're done Go ahead and then just DM me on my Instagram and say done And if you want to participate in um you know more of these giveaways that I'll be doing please don't forget to subscribe to my channel because I will be doing these like I said every two weeks I'm gonna go for every two weeks if I get enough people to view it then there's more people to participate so then I will do it weekly because every week I will not be giving a gift card to my grandmother and my little sister yes you Ava but I hope you guys enjoyed this video that's gonna be it for today again add her on Instagram Add me on Instagram, like the video, and then comment done. And I will be, and I will post um, in the comments, uh, depending on when I post this video, I'm gonna post in the comments the deadline uh, for the giveaway and where I will be announcing it. And I will be announcing it um, on my Instagram. So be sure to, but again, if you add me on Instagram, I'm gonna direct message you that you will want, okay? All right, I look forward to seeing you guys next time. Peace out.